From the Storm 5 Weather Center, I'm meteorologist Heather Mathis. On this Friday morning, we have made it to the weekend. Unfortunately, the weather is not cooperating for us. We've got scattered showers expected throughout the afternoon and evening hours. If you're sending your kids off to school today, make sure they've got the umbrella handy with them. 44 at 7 o'clock, 60 degrees as we come home. This is our weather kid for today. Her name is Bella Daniels, 11 years old from Wilson County over in Lebanon. Here's a look at exact track by lunchtime. Scattered showers staying south of I-40. We could even hear a rumble of thunder or two, mainly towards the Alabama border, but nothing severe expected. That wet weather going to continue into the afternoon commute, so expect some wet roads as you drive home. You're going to get used out of those windshield wipers. It stays wet through the evening hours, but after midnight, look at this. That's when we start to see a changeover, potentially, to a wintry mix with some sleet and even light snow showers, mainly towards that Tennessee, Kentucky line. So throughout the afternoon, some heavy your downpours south of I-40 by the morning time and early overnight. We're looking at snow showers north of I-40, so it's going to be pretty tricky heading into Saturday. Some really cold air going to usher in here. A light dusting possible on some grassy surfaces for our northern counties and out towards the plateau. But here's the thing. Our ground is going to be pretty wet from this event, and it's also pretty warm from today in the 60s, yesterday in the 60s. So I'm not thinking any big travel impacts by Saturday afternoon. We do start to see those clouds push out by Saturday night and those clear skies will really allow for temperatures to fall by Sunday morning. We're looking at another killer frost waking up on Sunday. Wind chill values. This is actually stopped at 10 o'clock in the morning for Sunday or Saturday. Excuse me. It's going to feel like the 20s outside Saturday afternoon. Even though the air temperature will be in the 40s, it will feel like the 30s through much of the day. So feeling like winter outside, even though of course it is spring here in early April. For Sunday, 54 is going to be our high after a very chilly start to the day. We get back into those 60s on Monday with a chance of rain showers, but the best part of the seven day forecast is Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Some nice dry days with temperatures getting back near their seasonable averages. Meteorologist Bree Smith will be back in later tonight with another update to your forecast. Here is our weather artist though for this morning. This is Lily. She is eight years old and she is from Spring Hill showing a car driving in, I think, to News Channel 5 station uh, with some nice raindrops there. Let's take a look at our school of the day uh, for this Friday. It's Baker's Mill Elementary. A uh, good morning to everyone in Clarksville and Montgomery County. Your today's school of the day. Hope you have a great rest of your afternoon.